today we are showcasing the Spirit Halloween 2023 Gordo animatronic. I will not lie, I probably should have uploaded this before I uploaded his unboxing video. But, I mean, who cares at this point? So, let's get into the basics. So, Gordo was sold at Spirit Halloween for the 2023 Halloween season. It's this gigantic pumpkin on a pretty big pillar. And when he activates, his mouth slash top of the pumpkin pops up to reveal pumpkin guts. And he, he, li he lights up. Um, this guy retailed for $149.99. And I got him at the 50% off sale for only $75 plus tax. So, let's just get into the details on this guy. Gordo has some really nice details. His sculpt is really good. As you can see, he's got lots of very good paint job. Um, vines are nicely painted. The pumpkin guts even look pretty good. They're just some cloth. This is printed. They honestly look quite real if you get a good angle. I probably might make foam pumpkin seeds and just attach them to him just to make it a little more realistic. And his pillar has some green cloth on the top, and it's basically printed. It does look pretty realistic when the cloth isn't, like, I don't know, looking weird or anything, but Gordo's got some really nice detail. Interesting thing about Gordo is this guy sold out so quick, and he was so hard to find. I have it a little zoomed out, so the quality is a little lower I do apologize for that. I just want to get a good view. But this guy was such a nightmare to find in stores. My store only got one Gordo. And I got him at the sale. Because the only one they got was the store display. I guess I'll just get into his demo. I'll turn him on right here, right now for you guys. I'll show him in the dark. And I'll show him as he is right now. So... Let's get into the demo of Gordo from Spirit Halloween. spirit halloween he's back in his normal position forgot i don't even keep him like this i keep him with his head up so his spring doesn't get worn out and i forget how short he is like he's short but he's pretty big um so quality of this guy the cloth is a lot lower quality than most props like you think he just used normal creepy cloth the quality is just a bit lower honestly and that's not really too concerning because it's just cloth you can buy some at a store or something mine is also just a little crooked i don't know if you can tell mine does look a lot better than most but here as you can see the, it's very off so i don't know if you could fix that at all or anything I don't want to break it or anything, so I'm just going to leave it as is. And speaking of breaking it, the quality of Gordo is actually very bad. Um, his mech is obviously horrible. It is sound and light. And one problem this prop has is the belt piece disintegrates almost all the time. So you're going to have to get new parts, otherwise will reset slowly and as you can tell mine is already broken so I'm gonna have to repair him before Halloween that way he can pop up quicker um the quality of his pumpkin is honestly really bad this is 
some really horrible material right here and it's hot glued on basically the whole prop is held together by hot glue the weld for this is absolutely horrible it is so wobbly and i feel like it'll definitely fall off over time like that is not good quality at all but i mean everything else is actually pretty good his pulls are really great quality um oh yeah another issue this guy has is the light in his head it gets so hot that it literally melts the hot glue that holds it together and it just falls off so that's another issue this guy has and it will cause him to be a lot dimmer so you're going to have to like figure out another way to keep it in place i personally use like some tape to keep it in place but quality of gordo it is pretty lacking it is sound and light animatronics and they are known to have some very faulty props but other than that gordo is really great i did not really like him at first but now after owning him i quite love him so I definitely recommend this guy if he does return. He was like one of the rarest props to find this year and yeah, pretty happy to have him. If I were to give this guy a rating out of t 5, I'd give him like a 4. Like he's almost perfect. Just the quality is lacking and it can be a lot better. One thing I also want to say before I end this video is the quality of the pumpkin is not the best. It's like your basic plastic material that can crack easily. So you need to be careful with that pumpkin. Don't put too much force on it because it will crack very easily. But that's all I really have to say about Gordo. Sorry if this video is a little shorter tonight. I don't really have much else planned. I have like one big video coming up. The rest of these videos are basically just going to be like filler video so yeah hope you guys enjoyed let me know what you think about gordo in the comments below and yeah that's really all i have to say thanks for watching if you have any more questions about this guy feel free to drop them in the comments and yeah this is the realist signing off